I got um, two things to say, and I really want to talk about Trials on Trial because that's one of the first projects I guess that you did, which looked at. It was like the bi- it's been the biggest one, like it's half hour documentary, yeah, and it, okay. yeah, it was yeah. Two things to say on that though, just just quickly, you said like people in these places that you're talking to. I was trying to campaign to get um, a pump jack in our local town, and the councillor involved just didn't like bikes, and it just wouldn't happen. It was literally a roadblock. What he did like was tennis. His son played tennis. So all of a sudden, in that village, there's loads more tennis courts, but there's zero pump tracks because he's just not interested. The other part, which we could probably get into as well, was my I've got a good balanced view in a way because my partner rides horses. And since the lockdowns and stuff, she's noticed way more e-bikers, which for a horse rider, quite scary Mm -hmm. because they come up quicker. They're making noise. They're usually probably coming down to them a little bit quicker as well. And there's just way more people out and about and with that new people who don't know how to s- go around a horse for example and it's all these little things though that are yeah. what tarnishes mountain bikers because everyone gets lumped in with <laughs> you know what i mean tom dick and harry that's gone down and bought a bike from his local bike shop and doesn't have any respect for anyone else out there using the same land yeah abs- yeah absolutely for both yeah. these points it, i mean as you say like it's i guess you've you've got the unfortunate end of the stick in that they're not interested in bikes yeah. you do see in some other areas where suddenly they might have a child who's into mountain biking yeah and it suddenly makes it way easier to yeah. have those conversations yeah. which i guess you'd hope all of these things would be impartial but Literally people are people <laughs> 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 um and then yeah so this like and we did touch on that in trails on trial like mm, how we ride when we're out on trails and being aware of where we are when we're riding so are we in a bike park are we in like um, an informal bike specific trail? Hopefully there wouldn't be anyone walking up it, but there might mm. be. And then are you on a shared path? In which case, like you really need to like give way. Yeah. Um, bikes are supposed to give way. So we've had it there recently, like especially the Peak District where I live has got way busier. Mm-hmm. And it's not just mountain bikers. It's just general people using the outdoors. Uh, and again, I think it goes both ways. You know, a lot of these people don't necessarily know what is a footpath? What isn't? And we've had people walking up trails, and you, it's it's gnarly. Like it, yeah, <laughs> you know, I think it does go both way, both ways. Um, and it's funny because we're in a situation at the moment where quite a lot of bikes bikers will go on footpaths because it's all you've got. But then mm. if someone walks up a bike trail, and you're like, it's a bike trail. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. It goes so like, <laughs> <laughs> there's there's like this figuring out how to share space mm. conversation. Mm. How how better to share? It's never going to be perfect. No, like none of it is going to be perfect. No. Um, but then this is like. So we did touch on this in Trails on Trial and like reframing mountain biking. So we've held two, mm, what do we call them? Symposiums? Meets. Okay. Uh, so one in 22 and then one this year in March. Uh, and a big, I don't know if you can hear my stomach rumbling there. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> like there's multiple kind of goals of reframing, you know, like trying to help mountain biking be more inclusive and appealing to like a wider audience like why is it maybe not appealing to some people or it might be intimidating well it is intimidating to Mm. a lot of people um and then what's this image of mountain biking (coughs) that's out there and also like again awareness of how we're riding on trails how we're interacting with trails so are we giving back to them and are we thinking about (coughs) if you're on a trail a mountain in the middle of nowhere and there's no way you're going to go back and fix the trail you probably shouldn't be skidding down it you should be trying to ride down it like yeah you know without yeah. putting too much wear on it yeah um whereas again if you're in a bike park or like you might be helping maintain the trail maybe that's more okay yeah. again that's very location and people <laughs> specific <laughs> um <clears throat> but yeah so this image of my well yeah so it's both there's an image that's portrayed of mountain biking so you go and talk to like councillors or landowners and they have in their head their idea of mountain biking what is that image Would quite nah is it yeah so it's like <laughs> most funny because my partner thinks of it the exact opposite <laughs> really yeah yeah like she's seen a few uh <laughs> don't know i can't go there don't worry like this well like, not cool yeah <laughs> <laughs> and a bit nerdy yeah. that's her view of it which is crazy isn't it it's like no no i'm joking <laughs> gonna say is that anything to do with your partner for no <laughs> that's an absolute joke <laughs> i guess um, it's like the general public's view of it so i she's guess thinks you're a nerd yeah <laughs> 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 well 
<laughs> I mean, it, I would say it is nerdy, yeah. So Yeah, it's different. But not. But that's not what... I, no, I we see it. Nah, yeah. You know? <laughs> but this is the thing we talk about in reframing, right? There's a whole spectrum of mountain biking. Like, bike nerds, I, don't, I wouldn't really... I'm not that worried about the specific things I have on my bike, as long as it feels good. Um, uh, and then, like, more extreme end. And then you've got, like, the proper adventure end. Or, like, just the bridal way. People who just love going out on, like, the access network. And there's, like, a whole spectrum. Um, so, like, how to make that image... Yeah, it's kind of skewed to, like, one end of it. At least for landowners. Probably because they hear complaints, maybe. Or, like, yeah. they see the, the the bad situations that might... That will happen. Again, you, it's never going to be perfect. And communicating that message as well is really difficult to get get these messages and these ideas to the to the people. Like, it might be really hard to get that message to not only a pro rider but also someone who is just new to biking or they've just bought an e-bike and the in the mid 60s you know they might yeah. n- not see the communications and i guess that's a lot of the challenge as well isn't it it's like how do you convey the messages yeah so there's yeah and and this is absolutely part of heard that one <laughs> Should we take a quick break? maybe if i finish my thought and then we take a quick <laughs> please four, three. um uh sorry <laughs> Yeah, again, in reframing, and it's, it's still a conversation that we need to, like, get to the bottom of, but we've talked about, I think someone said, like, if you buy a surfboard, you might, sometimes you might get, like, a little, like, card that might have, like, it's quite a lot of unwritten rules in surfing, mm. right? A bit like in a skateboard, you don't really drop in in front of someone, um, and probably, like, respect the, the place you're on, don't litter, et cetera. Like, yeah. just, like, a few, like, how to be, and this thing, like, how to convey that in a good way, or, like, in a fun way, you know, like, how to be a responsible mountain yeah, biker. Totally. Yeah, <laughs> but yeah. like, yeah, just these things, like think about where you are um, yeah. and who's around you. Give back to the trails. Um, you know, mm. I say thanks to the trail builders. Um, and it'd be cool to see something like that. And that's kind of brand led, to be honest, like bike shops. You know, you go to a bike shop, you buy your first bike. Is there a little bit of messaging there? Like mm. how, yeah. Again, this question, how do you do that? Do you, That's yeah. a conversation that needs to be had and we want to have. The, the conversation's got to start at the start with buying a bike. Almost. Yeah. Because how do you, yeah, how do you educate people on, yeah. on it? Yeah, and yeah, definitely, I think, at the bike shop, poss- yeah, and maybe online when you're buying stuff, but also, so you see on different trail groups, websites, really cool examples, like, ranging from, like, don't be a dick, to, like, yeah some other like style of getting that across but you so know, if I you say highs are really great yeah really yeah up by us yeah anywhere, um yeah. and then so like people are going on the website to be like what's what can i ride in my local area they might end up on that website and then they might see that there as well like some messaging hmm. um so things like that as well but yeah again like at least for me this is like <laughs> people have had these concepts um but i think it's still quite new yeah. This whole thinking about the image of mountain biking. Yeah. I think it's been quite, it has been quite narrow and it's broadening. Mm. Um, but there's, again, it's going to take time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But conversations are good to get that going. For sure. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hey man, what an episode that was. You did amazing in it. And so did you. You shone like a star. You shone like a moon. Can we also put something up here that you can click yeah. on for the next episode? How about we put a subscribe up there in the middle? Yeah, I love We're going to put idea. a video we think that our uh, lovely companionship yeah. will love yeah. on your face. On oh, my face? Yeah. So and they on can't my, see me now. Gone. And on my face, another video that we think people will love. And thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Please hit like and subscribe. You guys are the best. Peace and love.